Fucking man. Uh, uh, How's that? <laughs> anyway, you good morning. You are so good, John Florell. <laughs> um, three today, right? We're doing, yes. basically, you're covered the gamut of anything you need to peel. That's right. Between these three. Yep. This is from Tomorrow's Kitchen. You're getting all three. What do we have? The we straight? We have the straight peeler. Okay, you have your serrated peeler for really tough things like rutabaga, you know, those waxy rutabagas, yeah. or maybe even, even something as tough as a, uh, like a squash. Uh, and you have your julienne peeler, all three of them in your choice of color, and each one of them has its own vegetable holder. That's my favorite part. That fits part. right into the handle. This is what makes this unique and different. This actually will hold on to your vegetables so you never have to worry about cutting yourself. I'll show you that here in a second. So you get all three, $14.95. The red is what you're holding in your yep. hand right now, but we also have it in the blue and we have it in the green. So and whatever color, What all I three. love about this, now it's got two, a, a ton of different functions, okay? With a straight peeler, this is the one that you're gonna use for potatoes, apples, beets, carrots, pears, anything that you need to peel. It peels in both directions, so it's twice as fast as any other peeler. So you, if you have a bunch of carrots that you wanna peel down, or maybe you wanna do a little garnishing. It's razor sharp, it cuts in both directions, so it's twice as fast as uh, some of the other peelers out there. But I want you to see this because you can do things with this peeler because of its design and because of the, the, uh, the sharpness. You can actually do things like make carrot ribbons. You can do zucchini straws. You can do zucchini ribbons. You can make these fancy uh, uh, decorate. Listen, if you want to decorate a salad, all you do is make a bunch of ribbons like this. You roll them up and take a look at this. You can make little rosettes out of a, uh, even just out of, uh, yeah. you know, the, uh, the strips of a carrot. And then you garnish your salads like this. Everything all the way down to a radish because now with that holder, the way this holder works, okay, and I'm gonna show you this real quick and I love this because if you're gonna do something like a potato or how about this, how about a red beet? You ever peel a red beet? I in the not palm of your hand, okay? This is probably what, why. What happens? <laughs> you end up with red hands, yes. all right? Well, now your hands never touch the vegetable because you've got that holder that uh. stores right inside the peeler. So you can peel your red beets, you can peel a rutabaga, you can peel something like uh, those slippery, slimy... Uh, <laughs> a mango? Yeah, if you've ever peeled a mango so by hand, hard. it slides all over the place. Now, with the holder, it holds onto the vegetable so your hands are away from the sharp blades. So you can get a perfect job each and every time. And each now, one has the holder. Yes, it yes. all comes with the holder. Yep. Everything is dishwasher safe. Now I'm gonna pop this back in here. So you see how it fits right in the handle the so home. you never have to worry about finding it. It's always there. Now, all three peelers come in this set. If you think that, hey listen, what do you pay for just one of those old, remember the old grandma peelers I call yes, them? Yes, we all have That, that have been around for uh, like 100 years, right? <laughs> I, you'll pay, six bucks for one of these things in this store. And it only peels and one way. Yeah, yes, exactly. <laughs> That's it. Now, I'm gonna switch over from the straight peeler and I'm gonna go to the serrated peeler okay. because this one is the one that you're gonna use for those really tough jobs. Like I said, a waxy rutabaga. Or if you wanted to peel down an acorn squash or, a, or I mean, a butternut squash like this, <laughs> There's no way you could do this, even with a knife. The problem with a knife is you, is you get down into the meat of the vegetable. All of the vitamins and minerals are right underneath the peel, and that's why you just want to remove the peel, but leave whatever's left behind, because you're saving all those vitamins and minerals. Now, you can do all kinds of things with these peelers. This is probably one of my favorites. This is our... our, our uh, uh, julianning peeler. This one's the julianne. You can take a carrot, a beet, an apple, a pear, and what you're gonna do is run this down your vegetable and it gives you those long angel hair julianne strips. You're gonna love this for garnishing salads. I mean, you would pay you know, $10 just for this kind of peeler alone in any store. Now you can do this, Look, you get all three pieces. Look at this, I want you to see this. It comes out perfect for garnishing salads, or for or maybe it's, it's a, for a stir fry, or hey, if you're into zucchini pastas, you know, oh, I, yeah. we call them zoodles, grab a zucchini, and with this alone, just this peeler, you don't need one of those spiralizers. Uh -huh. uh, you, you can do this by hand with the peeler. You can make zoodles, it plate, plates full in seconds with this little peeler. I mean, just for this alone, look at that. 
<laughs> a little pasta sauce, you're done. And you're ready to go. You're ready to go. And so the holder that you had, you yes. said, you know, like the, the beets or whatever, but I mentioned kind of if you've ever like peeled something you accidentally kind of got. You mean like a nail or yeah, a, finger, you got a finger nail a or a knuckle? Too close. Yeah. Even for safety. <laughs> that's yeah, for safety, There's, that's the I love the holder. That's why we did that. I feel like that's so, wor yeah. <laughs> worth everything. So if you wanted to peel potatoes, here I'm gonna pull this one out and all you're gonna do is take your potato, put mm -hmm. the, uh, you just push it in the end. Okay. That's gonna hold on yep. to your vegetable. And now, all you do is go backwards, forwards, it doesn't matter. And what I love about this too, right here on the end, a lot of people ask, why is that little loop there on the end? Well, that's for digging the eyes out of your potato, so you don't have to peel it down and waste everything. And each one of them has that And too. each one of them has that, but it's also for doing things like this, for doing decorative cuts. So if you wanted to oh. make, uh, you wanna score your vegetable like this, or you can use that for making those thicker zoodles, okay? Okay, but I like it like doing this and then you can just take a knife and watch this. You've already got it done, but now you've made your pinwheels. Okay, Look, we're, gonna get a salad. we're gonna get fancy, we're gonna get fancy, aren't we? I mean, with these three peelers, it literally does just about everything you need to do in the kitchen. So don't forget, <laughs> but the cooking. Straight, right? Uh, that's what I said, and we we always say, John, yes. the part of the cooking we don't like is the prepping part. That's right. And I, I said before, we'll like talk ourselves cooking out of doing something. Cooking doesn't take time. No. It's the prep that takes all the time in the kitchen. We just and need with, the right tools. That's, you just need the right tools to yep. do the job. How about this, I started out making a little bit of coleslaw. If you like sauerkraut, if you've ever tried homemade sauerkraut, you can oh, do I that now sauerkraut. with the peeler. Because this straight peeler is so razor sharp, it does the work that you can't, you know, this does work that one of those big, heavy, electric, expensive food processors won't do. Now you can do it with this set of three peelers. I mean, I look at it like this, It's it, for each peeler, it works out to what, like five bucks a peeler, right? Yeah. I mean, if your fingers are worth a dollar a piece, <laughs> It's worth it just to have that this little. That was the best kind of math <laughs> ever. It's just to have that little holder. It's worth it because now, you know, a lot of people, everybody says, oh, never peel towards yourself. Well, now with this holder, you can actually you can. peel towards yourself because your fingers are away from any sharp edges. So you can do that precise work. You can do even the delicate work because you have that holder that fits right back, oh, that's wrong peeler, right back inside the peeler. So it all comes together like this, all three pieces in your choice of colors. You get your straight peeler, you get your serrated peeler, and you get that julienning peeler. That's the one that we did those long that was angel that hair julienne strips. So all three, you get under all $15. Three of them. Yep. <laughs> and you get the holder. And the holder's and come with them. And it's got the them. little plug in there to get all that's those right. little bad parts that's out right. of the potatoes and apples. <laughs> We're, this I mean, makes, it almost makes it fun. Kind of do it like does. all the decorative stuff also? It, yeah, oh, you can do all kinds of decorative stuff. In fact, you can even think, do things like here. I can, I can even peel a tomato. I mean. <laughs> Peeling a tomato. Yeah, and I can do fancy cuts with this. We can make a little Look. potato rose, little rose bud here. I'll, I'll do it quickly, because I know we're out of time here. But watch this, because here's something you can try at home. Instead of parboiling your tomatoes, just peel them. Now you have this here. I'm not gonna peel it all the way, but look at this. All you do is roll this up. Look, he's gonna make it pretty. And I'm gonna give you a little rose that you can carry around here for the rest of the show. To <laughs> I'll just carry you, this tomato <laughs> rose with me wherever you. I go. Yep, that okay. sounds appropriate. <laughs> John Flory, you, you didn't joke at the beginning of the of this uh, presentation. You are an appealing How's that? man. Isn't that beautiful? Look at. I mean, and best, that is how much easier can it get? But best you rose need I've a peeler. Ever had. There you go. Best rose I've ever I know. had. You can pin that to your uh, shirt as a corsage. Yeah. You get the the hungry guys will chase you around that way. <laughs> <laughs> if you're on a cheap date, you know you can use it as a corsage. <laughs> I'm gonna take my rose. Enjoy. Thank you, John Florel. Okay, I'm gonna walk with my uh, my tomato rose, but I'm also.